on everybody it's Brian with you from the game Common, and we are playing some more civilization 6 we're playing our Rome campaign and we're still at war with Germany I guess we're trying to make him hurt right now I suppose I don't really know um, we, we have a couple of our archers up there we're able to survive the first war with them pretty easily because of our mountain pass so I'm feeling pretty good about that now you guys should all have you're at 15 melee strength and I'm pretty sure that's because of Alpine I don't think archers have a default of 15, do they? Well, you're not in hills and you have a 15. Maybe. We need another builder because um, I need to fix some of my farms. Let's see. How much uh, How much does a builder cost? 230. We're making 18 per turn, so yeah, that's not bad. Uh, are we... We are the suzerain of Geneva, but it's not benefiting us because Germany doesn't want to freaking peace out yet. He wants me to pay him. Really? I like just kicked your butt, dude. Ugh, that's fine. So we kind of figured that was gonna happen. I'm hoping to actually shoot this guy dead. I'm hoping he's not gonna move away. Aha, good. So you're dead and you're now dead. How's it feel, Germany, man? Uh, I don't think I can do, even if I brought my warrior up here, I'm pretty sure couldn't take Mandenberg. If I did, I would probably just burn it to the ground at this point, honestly. So I want to throw down two cities. Number one, I want to put a city here. And then number two, I want to put a city over here still. Um, of course, he goes right to where I want to go. Yeah, I don't know. Let's go here. That'll be fine. We'll get one more turn to see if this is where, where we really want to go. I didn't realize there's a spearman there. That could be a problem. I think it won't be, but it could be. Do we want to bring another archer up here? Eh, why not? Sure, let's go. It's not like I'm really worried about... I mean, I guess barbarians could spawn down here, which could be a problem. I do need to throw a city down over here. Uh, one, two, three, four. Here, one, two, three. One, two, three. Get that. Get two fishes. Yeah, I probably want to put it right there on that hill. So, that'll be city number four. Uh, we will have a golden age. Yes, we are going to have a golden age. So, we want to be a little careful. Um... We would rather not meet too many other people right now or finish things that are going to get us more error score. I think there's what, like seven? Macedon declared war on uh, Poland. Interesting. Cool. I'm glad you like us. You're like the only person who actually doesn't hate me right now. No, nope, she still hates me. <laughs> uh, I think that might be a... I don't know. This might actually not work out too uh, well for Macedon. We'll see. So yeah, there's nothing up there for us. So let's go settle. Cool. And um, maybe start with freaking ancient walls. Let's grab the granary to begin with. And let's go heal you up. And can I just shoot the town? I can. Oh, we could totally take Magdeburg. We could totally take Magdeburg. Mm-hmm. So could buy a warrior. And then I can move him up here and probably take Magneburg without any issue. Oh, is it worth it? Is raising a town... I mean, I guess I could just trade it back to him, too. Well, here's the other thing. We're going to have Legion here in 16 turns. Um, But I don't have iron. Oh, I do have iron. Oh, okay. So, yeah, we really need to get a builder at this point. So in one turn, I think let's buy the builder. I don't think it's worth actually taking over Germany. No, no. Now, this is interesting. Mastodon's actually being uh, pretty aggressive this game. Here's the other thing. You're actually friendly with me. Do you, you want to declare friendship? Hey, okay. Sorry, I just bumped my mic. I bumped my mic again. <laughs> I bumped it with my nose. Okay, so we're friends with three people. Everyone else hates us. Seems about right. You are going to come over here, and we're going to come and start exploring Greece. Once again, I don't want to explore too much. Apologies, I'll look elsewhere. That was not too close. Don't even give me that crap. Uh, pff, Both of you. Don't even give me that crap. However, this is actually really good for iron, so sweet. Nalja Engineering has gotten boosted. So, first thing I want to do is I think I want to come here. We're going to repair, which doesn't use a build. Then I think we're going to come get the marble, and then I think I'm going to send you over here to get the iron mine. Which doesn't really matter. I actually don't really need it. 
because we're going to be able to build Legion anyways, because it's our unique unit, but still. Oh, this sucks. Yeah, we're going to put him here. We're going to put him here. And this guy's probably going to charge this guy, which I don't really care. They're not going to be able to kill me. Um, and I'm going to be able to kill him back, so sure, whatever. Uh, so we need a campus ASAP, plus three, plus three. Really, plus three is the best we can do. Even with a wonder there. Hmm. I need one more district. Now, okay, hold up. If I did plus three here, I could do a... Let's see, I think I need a barracks up here. So I could put it here and then put a barracks up there, a military zone. Which would just make it so freaking hard for um, the enemy to attack me from that direction. So yeah, let's actually shoot for that. And then this will actually become plus four. And we're going to bring you over here. And we want to go this way, just because I want to see what's going on over there. You're almost back at full HP. Cool. Our ship. Move in here, because we can right now. So the two greases are right on top of each other. Cool. Are they actually at war with each other, I wonder? No, but they do not like each other. We got tech boost for engineering. Why? Oh, because I built walls. Gotcha. Next turn. Yeah, and Alexander still hates me. You declared friend to their enemy. You are a declared friend. To oh, so he must not like Greece. Gotcha. Well, let's be honest. You already didn't like me, so sure. Now, she only hates me. Why is she denouncing the evils of Rome? That's so stupid. Literally, I think the only reason is because I didn't trade with her. So we may actually try trading with her as soon as we finish our trade route. Just because. Also, speaking of that, we have... Ro yeah, I love having roads up there. That's nice. Hey, you trying to run away from me? Because it really looks like you're trying to run away from me. I'm not going to let you run away, you little punk. Um, if he pieces me out, would I piece him out? It depends on what he's going to give me. No, he still wants me to pay him 17 gold per turn. Yeah, no. Piss off. <laughs> uh, okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. So then you just finished the government plaza which gives us plus eight loyalty to this city and increase plus one to the adjacency bonus earned by any adjacent district, which actually doesn't really help me here. Maybe I should have built it up there. It'll be fine for now. So I do maybe want a campus then because it's just going to give us plus one. This gives us plus two. Because it gives a plus one from there too. Hmm. Huh. What is the other thing? Settler. Yeah, let's start on a settler first, and then we'll go from there. So we can promote you once again, which gives you, while established in a city state, provides a copy of its luxury resource to you. Which would be okay. Or we can get loyalty to all our cities around them. Plus four amenities in the city. Hmm. Doubles the number of envoys you have there. That is ridiculous. Maybe we'll want to go with that one. So we can just stay in charge of... Geneva. The other option is it would give loyalty over here to Rome, but I don't think we really need the Rome. That's actually really quick. What uh, loyalty? Loyalty. We should be putting pressure on all these guys. We are, but they're still under full loyalty. You are actually losing loyalty. No, you're not. You're just like right at zero. You're actually going to rebel. I think when Frankfurt flips, Germany's probably going to piece me out at that point because he's going to be in a really awkward situation. Uh, okay, so I think let's go. Other option is I could do garrison strength plus five. Cannot be put under siege. Would also not be terrible. Bishop, don't care about. 100% yield, don't really care. All builders get plus one build charge, sure. Increase the science might also be good. Towards theater square buildings, towards campus buildings. Let's think about this. So 20% increase to science. Right now, you are making 2.1. 
When you finish the campus... You're going to get plus four. So you're going to have six science. So 20% of six is 1.2. We're making 11 signs. 1.2 is pretty minor. But long term and being able to speed up the, the speed in which the buildings get built, maybe it's worth it. And we do need science to catch up on. I think let's go for that guy. Yeah. Let's go for the educator. And we're going to put you in Anzo. Which is also going to help the loyalty. Not that I need it. And then you're going to be able to produce campus buildings a little bit quicker. I think all that will be okay. I do really like the idea of giving Geneva more, um, I just don't know if Geneva's gonna live long term. <laughs> like, I kind of feel like people are gonna come and kill him. So, sure. Uh, let's actually move you around. Sure. Let's move you back. You're pretty safe over there right now. Let's move you over here. There's Athens. Okay. I love how they were literally started right on top of each other. Uh, TSL for you. Okay, so you're gonna come there next turn. Alright, let's get going. Oh, hi. He wants to make peace. He wants to give me salt and eight gold. Three gold and then eight gold for 30 turns. Sure. I think I could get a better deal out of him. But I think I'm okay with that. Okay, so we can move our archers back. I almost should have pieced him out first. Or rather shot him and then tried piecing him out. Because I probably could have done more damage. But he did, does have a lot of barbarians. Which is a little intimidating. So then let's move you back over this way. Um, let's move you down over here. Just as protection. And then we're going to move you. Well, we can't move you because we just moved you. So you're just going to, I guess, re actually just promote you. Uh, range strength versus land units, please. Okay. And then I think we're good there. We're going to get another uh, city out over here, which is going to be fine. Why is our production... Let's actually take a quick look at our city. I want to see where our citizens are working. They're working that one, they're working that one, they're working that one. So they're not really working... I could build some mines, and that would help. Lumber mills would be really good, too. I don't think you're actually going to be working this tile, but I do want the luxury resources, so that's why. And then we're going to send you over here to get the iron. And that's going to boost iron working for us, which is going to be good. We will send you where? Let's start sending you up in this direction so we can start meeting people immediately next turn. Geneva made peace. Uh, they made peace with me. Yadwig built the Temple of Artemis. Okay. How far behind are we falling? Not too bad. Not too bad yet. I literally just got out of a war, and you're gonna sit there and yell at me for not being in a war? Are you kidding me? Ugh, freaking AI, man. I really need a builder here. What are you working on, Granary? Why not a builder? 19 turns. Hmm. All right, that's fine. So five turns till you get down there. We're probably gonna want to switch off. Uh, iron working before we get there. We're also going to want to buy that tile. You are going to come down here, and I'm going to put you on this mountain. Just kind of hold it for now. Ephesus is actually flipping. Hmm, interesting. Oh, they got closed borders, so we no longer can explore that direction. Cool. Well, let's go this way then. Ah, freaking closed borders, man. They got high enough in tech. Gorgo enforces borders. <coughs> cool. This Gorgo doesn't like me, little punk. Gorgo's probably going to start hating on me, too, because I'm no longer at war. She's going to be like, why don't you fight for yourself? And I'm going to be like, really? Seriously? Uh, let's put you over here, and I'm kind of protect this area. Because we do want to throw a city down. And I probably should get over here and put a city down before uh, Geneva expands in that direction. So I think my next city is going to go over there. Now, Geneva should not actually be pressuring me. Uh, okay. You're welcome. 
I only I'm only focusing on one city state and we are making plus two science now because of it because <laughs> we're at peace a whole plus two science woo we'll be making a like and what another plus like 0.3 science here in just a second so we're getting up there we'll leave you there and yeah you're coming over here we we'll probably want to get some more archers honestly probably actually just start building legions here and dang turns uh, we have sent delegation. Don't be alarmed. It is most welcome. Thank you. I will go buy this tile and then probably send him a delegation. Just so I know what's going on over there. Purchase tile 110. I don't think I care about the horses quite yet. Nah, because we're gonna want we're gonna want legions. Probably more than horsemen. And then hi. Take a delegation. Cool. How long till our trade route's done? I don't know. Is there a way to actually see how long your trade routes remain active? Trade route overview. 10 turns. It's going to take a total number of 10 turns. How many turns has it been going? Don't actually know that. So we'll sit here, fortify you. You're going to come down here. And next turn. So Greece. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We knew about that. Oh, Frankfurt didn't flip. Interesting. Politics is the art of the possible, the attainable. The art of the next best. Crap. We didn't want that. <laughs> uh, we should have waited. Oh, well, that's fine. Uh, you're now established, so we're making 15.3 signs. Okay. And Classical Roads has been upgraded. So now we're making a little extra movement per turn. The question is, what are my neighbors? What kind of governments do they have? You are rolling still with cheapdom. You are oligarchy. You are oligarchy. So it sounds like we probably want to switch our government to oligarchy. Which all land melee gain plus four combat strength. And we get more unit experience. That seems probably like a good idea for us. Yeah, I don't care about the housing. Plus one yield. Yeah, we'll do oligarchy. Cool. So we're going to keep maintenance, I think. Plus two trade route from all routes. I want plus two influence points towards earning. Yes. And let's get production towards Settler. I want the gold still. Production in cities, don't care. Purchasing tile, too late. We probably do want the builders, but not right this second. And we probably are going to start producing units, but not right away. So sure, I'll keep this going. Freaking hell, man. <laughs> I don't want these points. Ah. Ah, that's fine. That's fine. And then new Civic. Games and Recreation does go for the Coliseum. Which, you know, seems kind of fitting for us. Entertainment complex. I think instead, let's go for the theater square. Or... Yeah. Yeah, we'll do games and recreation. That's fine. I don't think we're going to be able to build the Coliseum, but we can get there. So we actually don't want to meet any civs, so I'm probably going to move you down a little bit. We got, what, like two turns left? So, Jane... So, cool. She's praying for me. Can I tell her not to settle near me? Because she kind of settled near me, too. Yay! Okay, we are now in a golden age. Hell yeah. So, uh, we can make a dedication. So, who's in the golden age? Alexander, France, Poland, Spain, Dutch. Germany, Greek, and Gorgo are all in a uh, normal... Actually, sorry... Pericles and Germany are in a normal age, but then Gorgo's actually in a dark age, which is going to be really bad for her. So you may make a dedication. So we can do Eureka's provide an additional 10% technology cost or inspirations or plus two movement for all builders may purchase units with faith. Builders and settlers are 30% cheaper to build with faith in gold. Huh. Or plus two movement for all missionaries. This one seems pretty decent, but I think I need to get Eureka's. Wait, Commercial Hub and Harbor District Gold Adjacency provide science. Ugh. Inspirations provide... I almost feel like this one's better. Are we making faith? We are making one faith per turn, and we're at 11 faith. So, probably not worth purchasing units with faith. We also, we're not going to get commercial hubs or harbors. 
So I think like this one's better. Inspirations provide an additional 10% of civic costs. But I don't know. I don't like any of these. I really don't. So you can get an additional 10%, which means we can catch up in science. Are we falling behind in culture? Most likely. You're making 19 culture per turn. I'm making 15. So we're not really falling behind. You're making 30 science per turn. Yeah, we're falling behind in science. But everyone else is pretty much near us. Mine a resource, we're going to get. Build a pasture, we're going to get. Build an iron mine, we're going to get. We actually need to switch text here because we went over on this. So, hey, uh, minor resource, switch over here. Something like that. Yeah, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna grab the science one just so we don't fall behind in science. It's kind of weak, but we can also buy this tile right here and grab some pastures and then get that boost. Probably not a bad idea. Uh, our settlers down to two turns, which is good. You're gonna get inside our borders, okay? You met Carthage City State. Hi. Were we the first one? I'm thinking no. I actually don't. I think so. I think we were the first one. Yeah, we were the first one to meet Carthage. Okay, they wanted inspiration for theology. You want us to train a legion. You want us to train a legion. So we're gonna get that pretty easily. We discovered a new continent. They're calling it Africa. And Greece no longer has enough loyalty to keep the city of Ephesus in their empire. Ha ha! So, could we actually go take it? Maybe. We don't have any troops nearby. I feel like if we had troops nearby, maybe, but we just don't have any troops nearby, so I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm sure these cities are gonna keep flipping or one of them's just gonna get conquered by like, like uh, Greece is gonna come there and start conquering them. We will probably end up backstabbing Greece at some point. Okay, who else needs to move? You're just gonna sit here and fortify up, please. And then you are going to actually start coming this direction because we want to meet new people. Amber. Huh. That's new. I like it. So Spain switched to Classical Republic. Dang it, Spain. <laughs> I literally just switched to Oligarchy for you, man. The Lord made us all out of iron. Cool. So now we can do Legions. And we got another boost as well. And so we got plus one error score. Cool. So... Yeah, wow, look at the wheel, man. It went to one turn. That boost is actually really nice. So I think we actually do want to come here for horseback riding. So let's actually move you here. And let's go ahead and just buy that tile right away as well. 120. Next turn, we can get it. Okay, so tech boost, tech boost. Cool. We got plus one error score. Cool. You're going to come this direction. We found the barbarian encampment. I'm trying to get over to Spain. I found a tribal village too, but I doubt we're going to be able to get up there to get that. Germany... Also lost Frankfurt. And they're about to lose mains. Don't hate we you. Invent. Probably gonna get shot again. Now, here's the thing, if mains flips, can we take it? That's a pretty aggressive push. I feel like we don't wanna go there. <laughs> I could go for it, I really could. But that, like, that means Poland's going to be on our borders, who doesn't like us. That means Netherlands are going to be on our borders, who don't like us. And Germany, who still doesn't like us. So that's where I'm kind of like, maybe not. Now, okay. You are actually going to rebel. So for that, let's go ahead and start moving some troops over here. Yeah, I think, I think we definitely want to go for you. We're going to go put you over here, please. And I think I'm just going to move and put you over here. Can I, I can't cross into the water yet. You actually have your first unit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want there. Okay. I clicked the wrong unit, actually, but we're fine. And then you're going to boost horseback riding, please. Cool. And I do want to put you down there, but I think instead we're going to take you over here. Because uh, I want to move you over here. So since we just finished the wheel, we should probably grab 
Shipbuilding. Own two galleys. Yeah, how long does it take for me to build a galley? Three turns. Yeah, okay, well, let's knock that out, and then we'll go start building legions. Okay, I'm happy with that. We'll just bring you up there, and then you'll be able to hop the water and come over here. Because this city is going to flip, and we're going to want to take it when it flips. Uh, Archer, you can level up. Plus five land strength. Germany is no longer loyalty. We knew about. We got tech boost for horseback riding. We probably need to end this episode, right? Yeah, we're at 25 minutes. Uh, let's keep taking you this way. Okay, let's do one more turn. Because I'm enjoying this. I... There's no... Mm. Maybe I can click on her and see a little more what she's talking about. Black Queen. I can't do espionage right now. So I don't know why she wants me to do espionage. We found Rome. Hi. Or Spain, rather. Can I open borders? I can't open borders. I can open borders. Aha! And that means you'll pay me a gold, right? Yeah. Will you pay me two gold? You will not pay me two gold. But you will pay me one gold. Cool. I want that. Thank you. So now we can pass through Spain, which is good. And we're going to explore the coast and come back around. Uh, you're going to have a galley here in one turn, which is going to be good. We found another goodie hut. Doesn't matter. We can't cross the water. Freaking river. No roads. You are going to just go ahead and, I guess, get right here. And prep. We really need to get a builder over here. Four turns. You're actually going pretty decently. Freaking Rome. Oh, also, too, I need to yell at you. Hi. Uh, don't settle near my cities. So, yeah. We're just going to yell at him a little bit for that. Mainz is about to flip. Magnenburg is also going to flip. <laughs> oh... Uh, I feel like I should come... Which was his capital? Oh, Aachen. Which doesn't flip. Yeah, that's right. I feel like I should come grab it. Actually, whoa, you're not losing loyalty anymore. What? I call crap on that. So then in that case, maybe we should be moving up here. Hmm... Maybe we do just want to start spreading that way. <sighs> I don't know. But for now, we're going to wrap this episode up here. You guys let me know what you think I should do. Um, as for me, I'm going to put a cut here. Hope you guys are enjoying it. If you are, drop a like, comment. Let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button. Join the game, comment, show your support. I'll see you guys next episode. We are still going to try moving over here. We can't move over here because you're in the way. But we are going to go settle right here. Um, that's going to open a lot of fish for me, too. So that's going to be good. But I'll see you guys next time. Bye.